Today, we're diving into the exciting world of ethical hacking by setting up your very own pen testing lab at home. Pen testing, short for penetration testing, is like being a digital detective. You're hired to find weaknesses in computer systems and networks before the bad guys do. This guide is your roadmap to building a complete pen testing lab. We'll cover everything from the hardware and software you'll need to setting up your computer and even your smartphone for ethical hacking. Whether you're a complete beginner or have some tech experience, we'll walk you through it all. So buckle up and let's get started on building your very own hacking playground, safely and ethically. Remember, knowledge is power and with great power comes great responsibility. Before we dive into the software side, let's gather the essential hardware you'll need for your pen testing lab. Having the right tools is crucial for effective penetration testing. Don't worry, you won't need a supercomputer. Many people think you need the latest and greatest hardware, but that's not the case. We'll focus on budget-friendly options that get the job done. You can find plenty of affordable setups that are more than capable of handling your needs. First up, you'll need a computer. This will be the backbone of your lab. A laptop is ideal for portability, allowing you to work from anywhere, but a desktop works too if you prefer a stationary setup. Aim for at least 8 gigabytes of RAM but 16 gigabytes is recommended for smoother multitasking. More RAM means you can run multiple virtual machines and tools without slowing down. Storage isn't a huge concern, but an SSD will make things snappier. An SSD can significantly reduce boot times and improve overall system responsiveness. Next, you'll need a smartphone. This is essential for testing mobile applications and network security. Android devices are popular for pen testing due to their open source nature. They offer more flexibility and customization options compared to other operating systems. You can pick up an older, budget-friendly model specifically for your lab. There's no need to invest in the latest model. An older device will work just fine. We'll get into why later. Understanding the reasons behind these choices will help you make informed decisions. Lastly, a good Wi-Fi router is crucial. This will allow you to set up a controlled environment for testing network security. You'll be setting up your own network for testing, so look for one with good customization options. The ability to tweak settings and configurations is vital for effective pen testing. Some routers even come with pre-flashed firmware specifically designed for pen testing. These can offer advanced features and capabilities right out of the box, making your job easier. Now that you've got the hardware sorted, let's move on to the software side. The right software tools are crucial for any cybersecurity professional. They help you identify vulnerabilities, analyze data, and protect systems. Think of these as your digital detective tools. Just like a detective needs a magnifying glass and fingerprint powder, you need specialized software to uncover hidden threats and vulnerabilities. The star of the show is Kaylee Linux. It's a Debian-based operating system packed with hundreds of pen testing tools. From network scanners to password crackers, Kaylee Linux has it all. It's designed specifically for penetration testing and security auditing. Don't worry, you won't be ditching your current operating system. We'll install Kali Linux as a virtual machine later. This way, you can run it alongside your existing OS without any conflicts. Virtual machines provide a safe environment to test and experiment without risking your main system. Next up, we have Metasploit Framework. It's a powerful tool for developing and executing exploits. With Metasploit, you can simulate attacks on your network to find and fix vulnerabilities before malicious hackers do. Think of it as your Swiss Army knife for ethical hacking. It's versatile and can be used in various scenarios, making it an indispensable tool in your cybersecurity toolkit. For network analysis, Wireshark is your go-to. It captures and analyzes network traffic, helping you understand how data flows between devices. This is crucial for identifying suspicious activity and ensuring data integrity. Lastly, Burp Suite is essential for web application testing. It lets you intercept and modify traffic between your browser and web servers, allowing you to identify vulnerabilities. With Burp Suite, you can perform comprehensive security assessments of your web applications, ensuring they are robust and secure against attacks. With your hardware and software ready, it's time to build your virtual lab. We'll be using virtualization software to create a safe and isolated environment for your pen testing activities. First, download and install VirtualBox. It's a free and powerful virtualization software that lets you run multiple operating systems simultaneously. Next, download the Kali Linux ISO image from the official website. Once downloaded, open VirtualBox and create a new virtual machine. Follow the on-screen prompts, selecting the Kali Linux ISO image when prompted. 
allocate at least two gigabytes of RAM and enough storage for your needs. Once the setup is complete, boot up your Kali Linux virtual machine. Congratulations. You now have a safe and isolated environment for your pen testing adventures. Mobile pen testing powerhouse, transforming your smartphone. Remember that Android phone we talked about earlier? It's time to turn it into a mobile pen testing powerhouse. First, back up any important data on your phone as we'll be wiping it clean. Next, enable developer options by going to settings, then about phone, and repeatedly tapping on the build number. Now, enable USB debugging within developer options. This allows your computer to communicate with your phone at a deeper level. Download and install Android Studio on your computer. It comes with ADB or Android Debug Bridge, a command line tool for communicating with your phone. Connect your phone to your computer via USB. Open a command prompt or terminal and type ADB devices. You should see your device listed, indicating a successful connection. Networking your lab, connecting the dots. In this section, we will guide you through the process of connecting your various devices to a network, ensuring they can communicate seamlessly. Now that your computer and mobile labs are ready, let's connect them to a network. This step is crucial for creating a cohesive environment where all your devices can interact and share data efficiently. This is where your Wi-Fi router comes in. Your router acts as the central hub, managing the flow of data between your devices and the internet. Firstly, connect your computer to the router via ethernet. Using an ethernet connection ensures a stable and fast connection, which is essential for tasks that require high bandwidth and low latency. This will be your primary connection for accessing the internet and your virtual machines. A wired connection minimizes interference and provides a reliable link for your pen testing activities. Next, connect your Android phone to the router's Wi-Fi network. This allows your mobile device to join the same network as your computer, enabling seamless interaction between the two. Now both your computer and phone are on the same network, allowing you to practice different pen testing techniques. This setup is ideal for testing how various devices communicate and respond to security tests. Within your Kali Linux virtual machine, you can set up different network configurations such as NAT or bridged mode, depending on your testing needs. These configurations allow you to simulate different network environments and scenarios. Remember, this is your own private network so you have complete control over it. You can customize the settings to match your specific requirements and experiment with various configurations without any restrictions. You can experiment freely without worrying about affecting other devices or networks. This freedom is invaluable for learning and honing your pen testing skills as it provides a safe space to test and refine your techniques. Documenting your network setup and configurations is also a good practice. Keeping detailed notes helps you track changes and understand the impact of different settings on your network's performance and security. Regularly reviewing network logs and analyzing data can provide insights into potential vulnerabilities and areas for improvement. This proactive approach ensures your network remains secure and efficient. Congratulations, you've successfully connected the dots and set up a robust network for your pen testing lab. With this foundation, you're ready to dive deeper into the world of network security and testing, securing your playground, staying safe while hacking. Before you start unleashing your inner hacker, it's crucial to secure your lab environment. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Firstly, create strong and unique passwords for all your devices and accounts. This includes your computer, router, virtual machines, and any online services you use. Next, enable firewall protection on your computer and router. This acts as a barrier between your network and the outside world, blocking unauthorized access. Consider using a VPN or virtual private network when conducting online research or downloading files related to pen testing. It encrypts your internet traffic, adding an extra layer of security. Lastly, always update your software regularly. Software updates often include security patches that fix vulnerabilities, keeping your lab safe from known threats. Practice makes perfect honing your skills. Congratulations, your pen testing lab is up and running. Now the real fun begins, practicing your skills. Remember, ethical hacking is a continuous learning process. Start with the basics. Familiarize yourself with the tools in Kali Linux, such as Nmap for network scanning and Metasploit for exploitation. Join online communities and forums dedicated to ethical hacking. Engage with fellow enthusiasts, ask questions, and share your knowledge. Participate in Capture the Flag or CTF competitions. These are online events where you solve security challenges to test and improve your skills in a fun and competitive environment. Remember, practice makes perfect. 
The more you experiment and challenge yourself, the more proficient you'll become in ethical hacking. Conclusion. Embracing ethical hacking. Setting up your own pen testing lab is a rewarding experience. It empowers you to explore the world of cybersecurity, uncover vulnerabilities, and contribute to a safer digital world. Remember, ethical hacking is about using your knowledge for good. Always obtain proper authorization before testing systems that are not your own. Keep learning, keep practicing, and never stop exploring the ever-evolving world of cybersecurity. Embrace ethical hacking, and together, let's make the digital world a safer place for everyone.